Hey guys and welcome back to Game Emotion. And today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to play your PS4 on a Mac or on your Windows. So it's the same steps. You just follow the same steps, and you can even play it on your Windows computer or your laptop. And if you follow the same, you can even follow the same steps to play uh, or PS4 on your phone, any phone. Okay. So for doing this, you need to have a PS4 and a device you want to pair the PS4 with. Okay. So let's get straight into the video. So in Google, you know, open up Google. It doesn't, it doesn't matter if you open Chrome or Safari. I'm using Chrome. So there you have to type PS4 Remote Play. Okay, and then you have to select it. And I'm gonna leave the link in the description for me, to make it easier for you people. So as you guys can see, PS4 Remote Play, Windows, PC, or Mac. Okay, so the PlayStation Net is the official app from the PlayStation. So I'm a Mac user, so I'm gonna be downloading it for click the Mac user. But if you are a Windows PC player user, then you're gonna use the Windows PC. You're gonna click this, okay? So I'm gonna download this, and then these are the getting ready, okay, and all this. So I will just download. Uh, go down. I'm gonna be looking for the Mac. So here is the Mac user, okay? So Mac user is down, and the Windows one will be up. So I'm going to download it for myself. As you guys can see, it's getting downloaded over here. Now today's downloading, guys, please subscribe to my channel. I will I upload very really regularly now. So yes. So now as the app is downloaded, you have to go to Finder, and then do downloads. In downloads, uh, you're going to be looking at this. This is a box, okay? It's called Remote Play Install Installer or PKG. So you're going to click that, and then these are all the installers so just continue and then go down some agreement so it's just if you want to read it no reason and then agree if you agree this and then continue okay so now uh, uh, today so this will take uh, 21.5 mb of the space of my computer so so i'll just install it now okay so now i'm installing so i have to put my password so Put the password. Now the installation was successful, so I can close this. So now it's your wish if you want to keep it and move to trash. I'm just gonna keep it, I don't know why. I'm gonna go to applications, okay? And then application is scroll and you can see the PSO remote play is here. So now you wanna click the PSO remote play. So this app is now you have to keep the Bluetooth on so my Bluetooth is currently uh, connected to my headphone so I have to switch to another headphone so now when at this point you have to switch on your um, PS4 okay so I switch the PS4 on so now we are in the PS4 you know go head to the settings and then go to the remote play connection settings guys you have to enable this remote play as this is really important then it will recognize that your PS4 is on and it will connect to your uh, laptop or your phone okay so now I'm going to click start now it's gonna look search for the PS4 and then it's gonna register it might take some time So now as you guys can see it is registered and now it's showing that it's using remote play okay. It's kind of on the side so now it's registering and then now it's going to be come on. Now as you guys can see it's connected to the PS4 as you guys can see in the screen too on the laptop one okay. So that means now the, all the control is on the of your PS4 using your laptop now okay. So now you can control it. So as you guys can see. Uh, now it's in my laptop, so I'm currently um, recording too. So as you can see, it's working. Okay, so that's how you record your the uh, you play PS4 on your laptop. It works for any Windows or PC, it doesn't matter or Mac. So thank you for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more such videos. Bye.